So I think you're probably either okay with this or you're not, I imagine. Although I don't know, it's a weird world we live in these days. I imagine that the majority of people would be against this due to possible potential unforeseen health concerns from lab-grown meat. Now, this doesn't have anything to do with video cards or gaming or anything like that. However, however, it is science fiction, except it's no longer fiction. It's fact, and this is happening right now. Boy, humanity has reached a point when we can grow meat now in a lab. It's hard to believe, but it actually is happening. And the next big push to save the world is cloning, cloning of animals. I just hope, and I'm not sure all governments will do this, is label, make it a mandate. You have to label the package. The package has to clearly state whether this is lab-grown meat or if it's cloned. Remember, if you enjoy content like this, you can help me out. It is completely free by doing what's up here. Like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and of course, comment. All right, so let's just quickly go through this article. And by the way, like I always do, I will link you to the article in the YouTube description down below. Now, this is a very polarized topic, and scientists actually view lab-grown protein, they don't call it meat, lab-grown protein, as a climate solution. And of course, they are in bed with the politicians and the companies, because at the end of the day, boy, <laughs> they're going to make a heck of a lot of money uh, from this, and they're going to try and make you believe that you, by eating meat, by eating regular foods, that you are the problem, you are the one that's killing the planet. So what do they do? They come up with solutions like this, and they also tax the living hell out of you. Or I guess they punish corporations and tax them, and in turn, corporations increase the cost of the foods. Scientists are viewing this lab-grown protein as a climate solution. They highlight its ability to cut land use and lower emissions. That's probably true, but at what cost? The cost to our health? We don't know how good this cooked up meat is going to be for us over the long term. Ranchers also see this as a corporate invasion. They warn it will lead to a collapse of rural economics and town life. Now the production of, my apologies for cutting off the video, but this is just a short part of the full length video which is available on my channel. If you're interested, please visit my YouTube channel for the full video. Thank you for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next one.